This is a picture. It's a picture of second trimester uh, scan of the fetus, showing in this arrow ecogenic power. To diagnose it, the ecogenicity should be similar to the bone, as we notice. This is the ecogenicity of the bone, and this is the ecogenicity of the power. If the, less than the bone or near the river, it's not considered as ecogenic power. Still, there is subjective debate in diagnosis of ecogenic bone, so the incidence or rate of this finding range from 0.2 percentage to 2 percentage. The discrepancy due to subjective change in diagnosis. In majority of the cases, it is isolated uh, finding in 75 percentage, and there is no other associated anomaly. The diagnosis is increased in recent high frequency probe used now in sonography. So if you have low frequency of five megahertz, you can use it to ensure your diagnosis. If you diagnosed ecogenic bowel, you should search for associated lesion like Down syndrome or cystic fibrosis or cytomegalovirus infection or due to intraamnotic bleeding and swelling of the blood, or lastly due to intestinal obstruction or intrauterine gross restric uh, restriction. If we exclude uh, Down syndrome and cystic fibrosis and cytomegalovirus infection, you should follow up the fetus uh, weekly or bi-weekly by an stress test and looking for intestinal obstruction in each scan till the delivery and after delivery, the new unit should be examined slowly and um, uh, follow up for at least two days after delivery. Thanks a lot.